hello everyone welcome back again to my channel and uh, uh, to my another new video in this video i will show you a complete setting for uh, keyboard and mouse uh, for uh, the legend of zelda uh, breath of the wild in your steam emulator so let's start so guys do not skip any part of this video i will explain everything uh, how to move uh, your character in this uh, uh, game uh, for your uh, CMA emulator uh, with your keyboard and mouse so do not skip any part of this video and uh, as you can see I have CMU 2.0 experimental if you have stable version so do not worry you can use your keyboard and mouse uh, very easily uh, to move your character in uh, Breath of the Wild so first of all you need some files uh, so uh, extra files so this is my extra files required files uh, I extracted with Windows first and open this folder mouse to joystick uh, custom CMU and you need VJoy drivers so if you don't have uh, these files then you need you'll need these files first of all extract it with Windows and install a uh, VJoy uh, drivers in your PC so open it now click on next and next and install uh, VJoy installed successfully you can see and go to your uh, mouse to joystick extract it with vendor and uh, open uh, this folder if you are facing any issue while opening a mouse to joystick custom CMU, uh, then right click and run as administrator. Settings are accessed via tray icon. So, okay, and over here you can see right click and open setting. Your mouse to joystick custom for menu settings are opened. So, for example, uh, if you uh, exit then you'll need to open it again okay but uh, we need some more settings uh, for uh, to use this mouse to joystick for a uh, CMA emulator so open your CMA emulator uh, but first right click and open file location go to your CMA emulator folder and go to controller profile folder and if you have any files over here then delete all files from here and go to controller profile copy these all files from here and paste here and go back and close it and close it and reopen your CMU emulator and go to options and uh, input settings and select your profile name you need to select VJoy device gamepad and click here select view gamepad and select your controller click here and select direct input and VJoy device and add and click on load after loading uh, you can see all settings over here load and all uh, settings already done and click on save and profile saved now close it and close your CMA emulator now go to your mouse to joystick so you can create a shortcut here now right click and uh, send to desktop create shortcut and close it and uh, reopen right click and run as administrator and click here so your mouse to joystick is activated now right click and open setting now go to hotkeys and uh, mouse to joystick click here and list key list helper if you want to change your settings for your key then you can select uh, any button on your keyboard to move your uh, character in in the game and I click here and I select I on my keyboard and I select O on my keyboard so you can 
select any button on your keyboard uh, to move your character and to select any item in your game so save and go to keyboard movement and if you want to move your character then you you can select custom settings from here click here i select my arrow keys to move my character in the game so click here i select up arrow and i select left arrow on my keyboard and down and left and save and ok now open your cma emulator and uh, play the game but play the game and if you want to activate your mouse to joystick and to so press f1 on your keyboard to activate mouse to joystick in semi emulator now press f1 on your keyboard so my, my mouse is disappeared so you can see i select i and i select start now you can see my mouse is working and I can uh, forward and backward my character and uh, yep my character is jumping you can see and if you want to change any uh, button on your keyboard to move your character then press F1 to deactivate your mouse to joystick for simu and go to settings right click and uh, go to settings and now you can change any button on your keyboard so i select f v and ok and uh, close it and for example your mouse to joystick is not working then make sure your mouse just joystick is, is activated for example i exit so i press f1 on my keyboard so my mouse to joystick uh, is not working then i need to restart the uh, my mouse to joystick and reopen it uh, now you can see my mouse to joystick is activated now right click and settings so i hope you like this video and i hope this video will help you if you like it then please subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching guys bye bye see you in the next video